Hello guys, it's Chamas and we're doing another Amiibo video. It's been a little while, but uh, we do have the new Splatoon 3 Deep Cut Amiibo. I'm just doing all of them in one video, kind of like the idea with the initial Splatoon 3 Amiibo. So first up here, we have Fry. There she is. And they have these like blank backs of boxes now. I don't know why, but yeah, I guess I switched to this anyway. Um, also got Shiver. Probably the hardest one to find, unfortunately, but... It is what it is. Have her now, which is very cool. And of course, this one here, which is the the big box here for a big man. And still, same kind of generic back of the box. Anyway, before I open these up, I do want to just give a quick comparison. Um, so you can see big man's box versus like a regular one. Quite uh, quite a bit different. This is like a three pack size box, which is very weird, but kind of cool. It makes sense, but. Yeah, anyway, um, I'm going to go ahead and open these up off camera because it, well, the rest will be here for like half an hour. So I'm going to go and get these things out of the package, then I will show them all opened up and whatnot. All right, have them all opened up and whatnot. So first up here, we got Fry. Oh, that is, that is zoomed out entirely. Okay, I forgot. Um, so she is. Really nice detailing on these. I, I noticed the Splatoon Amiibo just keep getting better and better with how they look, so very cool. Mask looks really nice as well, so really good Amiibo overall. Next up we have Shiver. Kind of a similar uh, style here. The mask, which looks really cool. And, um, yeah. Both of these kind of, again, similar to what we've seen before, but I would say just a little bit higher quality, which is nice. Very cool. And then probably the most unique of the bunch here is Big Man, and he is a, a large amiibo. I have to actually zoom out a bit for him. But uh, interesting they gave him, I guess, pink-ish ink there, I guess. Did he have that in game? I don't think he did, but that's fine. Um, been, a, been a little while since I played that boss fight. So yeah, anyway, very cool, reflective, um, it's kind of flat so I don't have to really show two sides, but uh, yeah, the tail there, really, really cool looking, and um, yeah, and then also again, his mask on his left arm there, or left fin. These Mebo videos are pretty short, but again, they are always fun, especially the Splatoon ones. I always enjoy taking a look at the Splatoon Amiibo because again, they are usually pretty high quality. I always like how the ink looks as well, so that's fun. So there you go. There's Deep Cut. Again, very cool Amiibo. Um, I might get some more Splatoon ones eventually. I am missing the Splatoon 1 alternates and uh, Actually, I'm missing the Splatoon 2, like the regular ones and the Octo ones, so I need to get all those. Um, yeah, and then I hear that there's something about some new ones maybe happening, I guess, so we'll get them if they come out. If there are new ones, I will for sure get them, but uh, as far as the old ones go, if I hunt them down for a decent price, I will pick them up. But uh, for now, we have Deep Cut. Yeah, is this the best Amiibo set we've gotten for Splatoon? Honestly, maybe. I still really like uh, Pearl and Marina, though, for uh, how they were made, but... Um, I would say, these are really nice, and again, Big Man is a very unique amiibo as well. Plus the other two, uh, Fry and Shiver, look really cool. So, overall, really, really good amiibo. Glad to get these as always. But, uh, yeah, basically all for this video. Again, pretty short, but really all there is to it. So, anyways, thanks for watching, and bye-bye.